Side by side with her is Nina Kucherin at the school record of the 200 IM and 200 press. She's a red shirt junior for Florida State. In number three, Roman Kova is a senior for North Carolina State, seventh in the NCAAs in this event last year. One of the swimmers to watch in lane number four, Alexis Wenger, the senior for Virginia. Has an eight cut time at 58.19, outswam that earlier today. Lane number five, Sophie Anson for North Carolina State has the best time out of anybody this season, looking to defend her title and the national champion last year. In lane number six, Heather McClausen. Really strong last year at the NCAAs, unable to compete due to an injury, looking to shine this go around in 2022. Atashkina, a senior from Louisville, experience at the European Games, also the World Junior Championships towards that outside. Farrington as well is in lane number eight for Louisville, eighth at the ACC's in this event last year. Brooke, you're going to focus on Wenger and Hansen yes. tonight. Yes, and this is, this is similar over the last three years. Wenger, in the past, puts together the top time in the morning, but Hansen comes back strong. She's the three-peat. Alexis has finished second behind her the last two years. Are we going to see the flip-flop tonight, or is Hansen going to finish off as the, the four-time ACC champion? It's a great start by Alexis there in lane four. Hanson last year getting a time at 204.87 to capture gold at the ACC's. Again, going for four in a row in the 100 breaststroke. Alexis lowered the meet and conference record this morning with her qualifying time, 57.22. Hanson was 57.60. 26-62 for Wenger for Virginia in the first 50. How about McClawson as well in lane number six closing in? And you can see that stroke style. Wenger staying a little bit lower to the water. Hansen comes up a little bit higher, just about a half a stroke behind on that turn. So is she going to have enough, or is Alexis going to finally get her hand on the wall first? A great race for these girls. I mean, this is what it's looked like the last two years. Here comes Wenger. Can she get there first? She can for Virginia. <laughs> Wenger gets there and dethrones the three-time champ. And for That's North Hansen. Carolina State, Hansen. Hansen's going to get the push. win in the championship. So wow. close. Just got there before. It looked like it Four was Wenger. And it, it really did. And, and I made this mention in the backstroke about getting your hand on the wall first. And, and it, it is tough to see, Dave. I mean, you look at you look at it and you look how they come in. And Wenger was just... And you can look at it here. I mean, watching the replay of it, she is just a slight half a stroke ahead, but it is the timing of coming into the wall, and Hansen just wow. reaches in that last stroke. A little bit taller. <laughs> That's where the, the height just plays into it, but Hansen just able to reach there in that last stroke. Congratulations to defending NCAA champion, it's Sophie Hansen. Continuing the theme of history tonight with four in a row. Wow. 5672 versus 5676 mm -hmm. over Wenger. Yeah. Pamankova for NC State takes the bronze. And Hansen breaks the pool record here. Gold medalist is with us. Congratulations, Sophie, on four in a row at the ACC's. What did it take on that final stretch of the touchpad to win gold yet again? Oh, it was an amazing race, and it was so much fun racing. Alexis, it's been fun racing against her for these past four years and really pushing each other and pushing our limits. Anson, how does that feel as, as now the four-time ACC champion, as you're, you're wrapping up your collegiate year, you've got another month to prepare. Is, is all of this just really becoming bittersweet for you? Yeah, I can't believe it's been already four years. It feels like I'm still a freshman, but I'm enjoying the last bit of it. Well, congratulations and good luck as you go into next month and return here for the NC2As. Thank you so much.
Sophie Hansen for the Wolfpack wins four in a row. Jubilation for NC State's Hansen. Going to continue her prowess for her teammates towards the rest of the championships here in Atlanta.